Christians and the uh, Carroll Girls and Track Coach are joining us up here at the uh, BV Invite today. And Coach, season kind of getting underway today. Uh, how many girls did you bring up today? Uh, we brought up 19 uh, girls today and uh, tonight actually. Uh, so we're getting everybody a chance to run. Everybody's getting a chance to be in a field event or a running event. Uh, at least two events, sometimes three. Uh, so it's a good, uh, good chance for everybody to get some uh, participation and see where we're at. What's kind of the main goals for today? You guys haven't got a lot of outside practice, so I'm sure this isn't a meet where you're really focusing in on times, I imagine. Right, we're not real concerned about places and uh, finishes and that type of thing. We just want to get to work on some basics and uh, get used to high jumping and throwing and long jumping and all those things and uh, just get a chance to run on a track. We haven't been on the track very much at all, so uh, it's a great opportunity for us. It's a long night, but uh, Everybody gets a chance, and uh, we do have enough time in between events, so the kids are still pretty fresh. But uh, it's just a good chance and uh, to get everybody involved and uh, see where we're at. How many girls went out this year overall, and what do you feel like the strengths of this team this year will be? Uh, we've got 19 girls uh, overall. We've got uh, we'll be strong in the hurdles with uh, Katie Trekker. She qualified in the 100 and 400 hurdles last year at state, placed sixth in the 400 hurdles. Uh, we've got three of the four girls back in the uh, four by one that uh, made state, set the school record uh, with uh, Katie Trucker, Lauren Janning, and uh, Allie Miners. Uh, we've got Morgan Cullen, she just had a PR tonight in the uh, high jump of 5 2, so that's a very good jump this early in the year. Uh, so we should be strong in those sprints, uh, short sprints, uh, and those field events, shot put, uh, high jump, and uh, disc as well as long jump, too. Coach, any young girls, like a lot of times you get a lot of freshmen out for track. Yep. Any of those freshmen going to make an impact uh, this year? Oh, yeah. We've got, uh, we've got I believe, eight freshmen. They're all going to have a chance to participate and help us out in some events, fill some events out for us. Uh, Kristen Honnold in the sprints, uh, she should definitely help us. Uh, in the distance uh, events, we've got uh, Taylor Gross, Macy Bach, uh, Sarah Steffen, possibly. Uh, and, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, we've got, uh, oh, I'm trying to think here. Uh, I can't remember all those girls, but uh, Emily, uh, Emily Dvorak, um, uh, oh, Cassie O'Leary, and just to name a few. So we're still kind of finding our way, and we'll see how it goes. But they're, they're all going to help and play a, play a part in our team. What will be the meets this year that you're kind of looking forward to, knowing that they're going to be pretty competitive for you guys this year? Uh, obviously, the regional meet at the end of the year is going to be real good. I'm not sure where we're going to be at, but uh, uh, Harlan will be there probably if we go to the same place we've been going. Harlan, Atlantic, uh, Preston's good. Uh, a lot of good teams down there. Glenwood's got some good events. So uh, the regional is always tough. Conference will be tough. And those are the kind of meets we gear up for. Uh, we do have a meet. Uh, Cherokee is always a tough meet. We'll hook up with Spencer. They got some fine athletes as well. So uh, those three meets are probably the, you know, the toughest meets. Okay. Well, Coach, I appreciate you joining us today. Thank you very much. You bet. Thanks.